We're concerned that AI could potentially cause the risk of human extinction. And the folks at Bay Area Based Center for AI Safety aren't the only ones who share that concern. The nonprofit drafted this one sentence statement that's now making headlines worldwide. It's a warning that says, quote, mitigating the risk of extinction from AI should be a global priority alongside other societal scale risks such as pandemics and nuclear war. Making it even more powerful are the big names who signed it in agreement, including Sam Altman, CEO of OpenAI, who's behind ChatGPT, and Jeffrey Hinton, who's called the godfather of artificial intelligence. After we got Jeff Hinton, then it became a lot easier, and um, we weren't even anticipating getting many of the industry leaders. The industry leaders include high-level executives at Microsoft and Google, along with hundreds of other experts in tech. Dan Hendricks is director for Center for AI Safety. We are in an AI arms race. The companies are needing to compete with each other. They're needing to develop AI as quickly as possible. And they then put development of AI and making it more powerful over making it safe and understandable and transparent. But he says the risks run deeper. Another possibility is that we automate so much of the economy that we have and basically the world is more autonomously run and we don't know how to do things. We become very dependent on them and we're completely subject to them always doing our bidding. If they turn in another direction or pursue something else, uh, then we'll, we'll be powerless to correct it. San Jose State professor and tech expert Ahmed Benafa says he also signed the statement, adding that it makes sense that some big names decided to do the same as they may want to wash their hands of critical responsibilities. When you have few companies controlling this, then those people are going to control the world. Those people can direct technology, direct uh, society, and have you know, tremendous power. Hendrick says the hope is that the statement and its support can lead to other leaders and policymakers recognizing the severity of the growing risky technology. If we treat it like a global priority and cooperate as we did with nuclear weapons, we could make the risks be substantially more manageable. Um, but we'll need to be proactive about that. Zach Fuentes, ABC7 News.